Hey guys, what's up? It's Retro Mikey 78 here, and today we are opening up the February 2020. Hey guys, what's up? It's Retro Mikey 78 here. Today we are going to open up the February 2021 Jeff Box. You guys don't know what Jeff Box is? It's another subscription company where they send you random games from what you don't put you put on your list. Um they have three tiers. They have one that's uh, about a thirty-something dollar tier, one that's a fifty, and then a hundred dollar tier. Um, I'm doing the medium tier. Uh, I don't remember exactly what games I'll try to put, or not games, how many games you get per system. But this company is different from VGM and Retro Game Treasure. They're saying that they're going to give you better quality of games. So that's what we're here to test. And see if we are getting um, higher dollar and better quality titles in the package. That's what I'm hoping for each and every month. Last month they did a great job. Um, it was $20 over more than I paid. So let's see what we get today. And I um, learned about these from Coopal of Nerds. They um, are getting this too. And wow, it's really sealed up in here. So I have talked Bone Z06 into getting this. He has not done a video yet, but he um, did receive his first month and he was happy with his first month, even though he didn't get his, um, oh, what is it, his um, list done before they sent it. Um, one of the downsides to this is they want you to go on pricecharting.com and use theirs. So, all right, this is the game and the Jeff Informer. They send out this, and it's quite informational. I'm not going to read everything to you guys, but they send this out, and wrote on the card it said, "I did not inhale." I guess from when he opened it but inside we have two bundles so I'm very interested to see what we got um, those of you who saw last month I got a sealed switch game um, Splatoon 2 that was worth most of the box try not to cut deep because I don't want to cut into anything all right, I see a Sega Genesis game right off the top. We have Bugs Bunny in Double Trouble. It's in good condition. So, got that. What else we got in here? Uh, this is a Nintendo DS. Wow. The seal's almost broke on it, but it's technically sealed. This is an interesting game. My Stop Smoking Coach. So, anybody need to stop smoking out there? Here you go. Next, um, feels like a Switch game. It is. Actually, I think this game is, just came out here recently. So this is actually really cool. Um, Cat Quest 1 and 2, the Possum Pack. That is awesome. Sealed Switch game. Two months in a row. That is one thing I'm really liking about this um, service. And next is an Xbox One game. Okay. Far Cry 4 Limited Edition. Give me something else to put in my backlog. It's in excellent condition. So. Right now, right now, I, I, I'm already happy with the box. And I've got a whole nother envelope here to open. So, let's see what we got in this one. All right, a NES game. Um, Cano Carve Canova, I know I'm probably butchering that, but 
Carnova. I've actually, I've had this before, but I haven't had it for a long time in my collection. This is back when I, before I purged my collection, I was younger. And the last game, I don't own this. No, we don't own that. That's weird that we don't own this. Everybody owned the copy of this. We play. We have the We Play uh, Motion. I think I sold this because we didn't. There wasn't much we liked on We Play, but I think we kept the We Play Motion. Now I'm gonna actually look again. We fit. We. Yep, we have We Play Motion, but we don't have We Play. So, all right. This is what I got. Um, I'm gonna take a minute. Um, go to pricecharting.com, see what these games are worth. We'll come back and tell you if it was worth what I paid. All right, guys. So we um, looked up all the prices of all the games, and I've got them here. I wrote them on the back of one of the envelopes. Um, I'm going to count this as sealed, even though you know it, it's starting to crack, whatever. But this is um, actually the cheapest game that was on pricetrading.com. That was cracking me up. My smoking coach um, for $6.52. Pretty fun. Um, Bugs Bunny and Double Trouble was $7.38. Carnova. I don't know why I say uh, Carnov. Carnov. I still... I, I don't know how to pronounce it. I know I'm screwing it up. Um, this game was $7.67. We Play, surprisingly, was $7.69. And that really surprised me. This was a complete copy. Far Cry for the limited edition for the Xbox One is $7.59. But still, Xbox One game, it's nice to get. And a sealed copy of Cat Quest 1 and 2 for the Switch is $29.17. Grand total for all these games, if I was to pay what they were actually price trading has them at, would be $66.02. I paid $59 plus shipping, which is, I think, $7.99. But I don't count shipping because if I bought these separately, I'd have to pay shipping. If I went somewhere, I'd have to pay gas. So I only count what I pay, the $59.99. So am I still getting my money's worth out of this? This box, even though it's not a money value as it was last month, was I think 18 bucks, almost 18 bucks over. This month, I, I really like this game. Um, I like getting an Xbox One. I, I think this is just hilarious. I didn't even know this game existed. Uh, I almost want to open it up and play it just to see what it is. Because it says, My Smoking Coach with Alan Carr. Alan Carr's Easy Way. What? I, I'm just curious. Did this help anybody? Did anybody stop smoking with this? That that really, really cracks me up. Uh, G, EA rating everyone in a use of tobacco. It just, it's cracking me up. I don't know. But, hey, um, hope you guys enjoy this. We are definitely going to keep trying this out. Um, I might adjust what I get a little bit. I said I was going to do three months like this, and I'm going to hold that. I'm, it renews um, next week. So we're going to do another month um, exactly like this. And then we're going to sit back and I'm going to decide, do I still want to do Sega? Do I still want to do Nintendo? Do I want to do the Game Boy Advance or Game Boy? I don't know. Right now I have every system that could possibly be marked because I'm just curious and want to see what he sends me. Hope you guys like this. Um, look it up. I'll leave a link down below in the description. Um, check out Coopal of Nerds and um, I hope Bonezeal6... Uh, releases his um, boxes soon on film. I'd like to see his reaction of getting some of these because he probably like he probably really enjoyed this game. I know he didn't have much much switch. Um, stay tuned later and we'll be back shortly.